Hello everybody. Hope you all are doing well and hope you all are staying safe. This is Dimple here again welcoming you all back to my next tutorial on Android framework components. So today we will see few ADB commands to enter and exit into the DOS mode. So let's get started. Before moving on to the commands part, I will explain in brief what is this DOS mode. So DOS mode in Android was introduced by Google from Android Marshmallow onwards to um achieve battery optimization okay so uh, google is coming up with battery optimization and security policies with every version of android it's incre uh, it's releasing your uh, what will happen in the dos mode is that when you are not using a device okay uh, when you have not charged when you have not put your device to charge you are not using your device for some point of time the android os will recognize that your device is idle for particular time when the device is idle for particular time android will put the device into the dos mode okay what exactly will happen in the dos mode so all the background applications which is consuming cpu and the internet those will be prohibited so i cannot use cpu i cannot use uh, uh, internet and wifi scannings will be prohibited that means uh, when my android phone is looking to connect to a new wifi router that will be prohibited so all these background operations what will do it will always consume the battery making your device battery which will get over in a very short period of time you have to keep charging your battery since every now and then okay so avoid to avoid all those things a dose mode was introduced so in dose mode the long running background operations are cut down so that your battery will last for a longer time and dose mode uh, what happens is when you charge your device when you put your device to charge the device will not enter to dose mode because that time your device is active okay so this is what dose mode is in order to extend the battery life the device goes to dose mode android will recognize and it will put into dose mode so that the long running uh, background operations are cut down but what what happens like we really have an application and we really need something to run in background so for that maintenance window was introduced okay so for example here my device is in dose mode i have left the device stationary for some time it is in dose mode then i enter the maintenance window so in this maintenance window the device will come out of the dose mode that means the android will give permissions for all the network related and cpu related and background running operations operations to be executed so in this particular time frame this orange window you can see right only in this time frame all the apps are allowed to access the resources and they will be executed again once this time frame is done again the device will enter dose mode so only every now and then android will give you permissions okay in the form of maintenance window to run your application so this orange bars are there no only during these times your apps are allowed to be executed they are allowed to consume the resources the internet wifi all such things okay so this is the concept of dose mode we will see uh, what are the commands uh, used to force the system to dose mode okay so I, as i already told you have to remove your device if it's been put to charge okay suppose uh, to run these adb commands we have to connect our device to the laptop or pc that time uh, the device will start charging so to disconnect it from start, uh, charging first we will execute adb shell dumpsys battery unplug so unplug means it's almost equal to the device is not being connected to any charging source including your laptop after that this is the main command which will force the device to dose mode okay so adb shell dumpsys device idle and force idle this command if you execute your entire device will go to dose mode all the background running operations will be prevented 
so when you go to dos mode if you execute this adb shell dumps is device idle command you have to see this m state okay so m state value will be idle so when the m state value is idle it means that your device has entered into dos mode so this command you can use to verify if the device has entered into dos mode so here my state is idle and obviously my device has entered dos mode now command to exit the idle mode to how to come out of the dos mode then we have to use adb shell dumps is device idle unforce so when i use this command uh, it means that i have come out of the dos mode and again to check the status of my device i again use adb shell dumps is device idle here a should be small letters and uh, m state here is active that means my device is in active state it is not in dos mode and uh, after i uh, enter my device to dos mode and when i come out of dos mode to reactivate the device just run this adb shell dumps is battery reset command now your device will be as normal so you can perform this small uh, experiments to understand more about dos mode uh, how these commands work and what your device status will be there so that's all i wanted to explain in this particular tutorial uh thanks everyone i hope this was informative and helpful i'll see you all in in the next tutorial until then everyone take care bye stay safe